I'm Simon Brown, the General Manager of Accelerator Services for Callahan Innovation. Uh, Callahan Innovation is New Zealand's innovation agency, so we focus on assisting businesses on their innovation journey, and we do that through a range of mechanisms. Um, we, we provide them access to over $140 million worth of R&D grants per annum. Um, overall, we're probably investing north of $200 million per annum in, um, into the New Zealand innovation economy. Um, and so we support those businesses with assisting their R&D programs through the provision of our own R&D capability to help them with that around product development, um, and then a range of sort of non-technical innovation services. Well, our main focus in being part of the program was there are, uh, we've brought with us, I think, 24 New Zealand-based companies. I think the delegation is about 30, 32 people in total representing those, those organisations. Um, and the main aim was to expose them to a number of things. A, a, to get a better feel for the opportunity that exists in ag tech within the US market. Um, I, I guess, secondly, to understand some of the uh, trials and tribulations and p potential pitfalls in trying to access this market. Um, and thirdly, really trying to introduce them to some people, um, be it partners in the market, corporate investors, potential customers, um, financial investors and so on, to help round out their knowledge of what they need to do, how they make themselves relevant for this marketplace, and how we can best equip them to succeed in taking their innovations to the US market and onto the world. I, it's been absolutely fantastic, exhausting, <laughs> very full on, uh, a very full agenda, um, which when coupled with you know people flying in from around the world um, can, can be a little challenging, but I think that in itself um, identifies how much um, enthusiasm and passion we have and the team have had for it because they've battled through that and they've you know they've seen um, some amazing insight they've gained some amazing insights, met some um, extraordinary sort of customers. And um, I think you've done a really good job of bringing together sort of a, a wide range of the sort of the, the influencers or actors, the people from within the system they may need to touch to give them a really wide ranging view of, of um, uh, you know, issues they'll need to think about and people that they can then uh, work with uh, going forward. I mean, I think that, like always, the exposure to the range of technologies, the understanding as to where, where we stand in the level of advancement of our own innovation and the things our customers are doing has been really, really valuable. Um, it's great to see technology in application in the field. It's great to talk about to the, to, to the growers associations, Western growers and others, about where are they taking things. Um, you know, you can, you can look at the technology, the investment, the challenges, the legal side. I mean, all of those things are really important, but I actually think at the end of the day, the most important thing about delegations like this is the people and the conversations they have. Um, as I mentioned to you yesterday, I mean, it's when you get on the bus after a session and all you can hear is people excitedly talking from, you know, for an hour from one visit to the next one, that is where the real gold is. It's those connections, those conversations, and connecting people with people. Because um, at the end of the day, you know, you can have the best technology in the world, but without you know, tapping into people and customers and markets and that understanding, you won't succeed. So that's, for me, the real gold nugget in the whole thing. Yeah, well, undoubtedly, um, this is a, a really important investment of your time and energy. Um, we've obviously focused this one around ag tech. Um, we've, we've run sort of similar events as Callahan around sort of Maori economy and food and beverage sector. And I think this is something that we should be looking to repeat um, because it, for all the reasons I've already described about those connections and the exposure and so on. So uh, yeah, definitely to all of you out there, um, you know, em embrace these opportunities. Um, it is a great way to do it as a collective. Some people would say, well, I, I can do that. I can get on the plane and go and do it myself and visit some people. Well, you, you can't. You won't get access to the same level of assistance, the same level of, 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 of um, person within the various entities we're talking to. Um, but that's also missing the point. It's about being here as a collective, as a cohort, and understanding one another's different perspectives. People get different things out of the same conversation you know, with, a, with a particular presenter. 
um, and it's then sharing their perspectives on that is where actually those aha moments come from. So I personally think it's really important to do it as a cohort within a delegation and as an investment that every organisation should be looking at making.